Good morning. For the last several weeks, we have been hearing stories from the Gospel of Matthew. Stories about Jesus sharing God's holy wisdom with his friends and his followers. All of these stories have meant to show us how Jesus has gently shaped the hearts of those who follow him, shaped the thinking and the attitudes of those who follow him, changing in many ways the old attitudes that they had possessed and replacing them with a new way of seeing and understanding. All of these teachings, all of this preparation, all of this shaping has been what we might call formation. Jesus' friends and followers have been formed so that they might now go out and make a difference in the world. That is today's gospel story. Jesus now sends out his followers and his friends. He sends them out into the world with the very grace of himself so that they might act in the world as Jesus acts in the world. He sends them out to heal, reassuring them that he has given them everything they need to heal others the way they have seen him heal. These stories are not just yesterday's stories. The word apostle means one who is sent out. You and I, too, are apostles. By the grace of our baptism, by the grace of confirmation, by the grace we receive whenever we meditate on God's holy word, the nourishment we receive whenever we receive Holy Communion, all of this is God's sharing of himself with us so that we too might go out into the world to heal. That is our vocation. Each one of us, in the unique circumstances of our own life, each one of us, as we walk our own unique journey in the world, is sent out by Christ to heal others by our compassion, our kindness, and our witnessing to God's holy presence in the world. Where are you going today? Perhaps in the spirit of today's gospel, where is God sending you today to be an instrument of healing?